godliness, cleanliness and punctuality are the necessities of a good business. This firm has reduced the hours of work and the clerical staff now only have to be present between the hours of 7am and 6pm on weekdays. Daily prayers will be held each morning in the main office and the clerical staff must be present. Clothing must be of a sober nature. The clerical staff must not wear bright colours, nor will they wear hose unless in good repair. Overcoats may not be worn in the office, but neck scarves and headwear may be worn in bad weather. A stove is provided for the benefit of clerical staff. Coal and wood must be kept in the locker. It is recommended that each member of staff bring four pounds of coal each day during cold weather. No members of clerical staff may leave the room without permission from Mr Rogers. The calls of nature are permitted and clerical staff may use the garden below the second gate. This area must be kept in good order. No talking is allowed during business hours. The craving for tobacco, wines and spirits is a human weakness and as such is forbidden to all members of the clerical staff. Now that the hours of business have been drastically reduced, the partaking of food is allowed between the hours of 11.30 and noon, but work must not on any account cease. Members of the clerical staff must provide their own pens. Mr Rogers will nominate a senior clerk to be responsible for the cleaning of the main office, and all boys and juniors will report 40 minutes before prayers and will remain after closing hours for similar work. Brushes, brooms and soap are provided by the owners. The owners recognise the generosity of the new labour laws and will expect a great rise in output of work to compensate for these near-utopian conditions.